Hello everybody, I have some really exciting news. I am restarting learning Thai. So you heard right, Thai is back. I started learning Thai in university and now I would like to tackle it again. It was extremely hard when I learned. All the characters looked the same to me. Uh, and it's a tonal language, which is very, very difficult. But I'm willing to take the challenge. And today I'm going to take you through how I create a language learning plan for Thai. And it's completely natural, unscripted, unplanned. I'm just going to show you exactly what I do when I start learning a new language absolutely from scratch. All that I can say in Thai is Sawaddi uh, ka di chan chu lindi which is hello my name is Lindy thank you that is all the Thai I know and I'm gonna challenge myself give myself about two months or so to see how much I can learn um, so let's go for it let's dive straight into the video the absolute first thing I'm doing is asking people online for their recommendations for Thai resources so I really hope that these are going to help me get started. I know TyPod 101 is reliable, so I'll definitely use that one as a resource. Yeah, let's take a look. Obviously, the first thing I need is a brand spanking new notebook. How cute is this one? Super keen to get started. And I'm just going to start uh, looking at the resources that people have recommended for me. And I'm going to write them in my notebook. So step one is done. I've written down all of the resources that I could find so far. And I forgot about the basic resources that are usually helpful, such as Memorize. They probably have a Thai deck and I can take some language lessons on... I can use Tandem to talk to people and I can take language lessons on Preble or Italki. So my next step is to create a language learning calendar. So I'm just going to open my calendar here and schedule in some time for me to do Thai because I know if I don't do that, I'm going to just be completely distracted. So let me schedule in some time and see where I can learn Thai. I'm only scheduling in time for the next few days because I don't know what my work schedule and my life schedule is going to look like. So I'm only scheduling for today, tomorrow, and the day after. Now the fun part is actually deciding what steps I'm going to follow to learn Thai. First would be learn the alphabet, or rather the writing system. Number two would be focus on the tones, because Thai is tonal and that's really difficult. Number three would be YouTube um, video lessons. So now that I've established the steps I'm going to take, now is time to actually dive into these resources and to start teaching myself the Thai alphabet. I'm not actually creating such a robust study plan as I am collecting resources and trying to scope out how they would be helpful for me. So I'm going to open up my laptop again and I'm going to see where I can find the Thai alphabet. Man, I fall for these things so much. Yes, I do want a Thai ebook. Give me everything. Oh, whoopsie. Oh, okay. So Ling has some videos on writing the Thai language. Oh my goodness, this is going to be so hard, guys. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I have to start learning the alphabet. And then there's consonants and Thai vowels. Oh, I just need to dive in. I just need to start. Okay, now the first thing that I've written in my notebook is to learn the Thai alphabet. And I found a useful video, which I'm just going to start watching and hopefully write my first letters. And your first Thai consonant. Let's begin. Let's start with the letter Mama. 
Okay, let me try writing the mama letter. Loop. And then back up. See how easy that was? No. Now you're going to learn your second consonant. The next consonant is nanu. No, it makes no. a sound mm, just like the letter N. Okay. Do you know what animal nanu is named after? No. Nu means rat in Thai. That's so cute. I bet you're thinking that nanu looks very similar to mama. It does. Well, you're right. And the loop is in the lower right corner. That was terrible. Now you know two Thai consonants, but we need to learn some vowels. No, show me again. And the loop is in the lower right corner. Sara a is a long vowel that makes the sound a and uh. the a in father. Let's practice writing it together. Mama, sara a, ma, ma. So this is mama with sara a, which makes ma, ma. Many yeah. Thai consonants have different sounds at the beginning. I found a level test on ThaiPod101.com, uh, Diagnostic 1. I don't know any Thai, but let's see how I do. I also found on ThaiPod101 that there is the Core 100 word list, which is a vocab list. Um, maybe that's how I learned to write, if I just do this. This looks pretty useful. Satani you like Jatini Leg Leg I know this is a K, this is Gog Guy, I think. Leg 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 D D Pak D Samrap Kun Pak D Samrap Kun Pak D Samrap Kun Pak D Samrap Kun I'm going to practice my pronunciation using this 101 words list and just shadow and copy what they're saying. So week is sapda 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 there are 7 days in a week. They're so fast. ในหนึ่งสัปดาห์มีเจ็ดวันในหนึ่งสัปดาห์มีเจ็ดวันในหนึ่งสัปดาห์มีเจ็ดวันในหนึ่งสัปดาห์มีเจ็ดวันในหน